Hey folks, I've got a special treat for you today. My little cup battle today is against ISS of Smogon. Now, for those of you who don't know, ISS is a huge deal when it comes to Little Cup. Um, he created one of the best 4th gen Little Cup teams, and he's a huge player in 5th gen Little Cup, has been ranked number one. I've battled him many times before on Pokemon Online, and I'm pretty sure actually he's used this team against me before, and I obviously use this team because I use Pokemon Online, online to test out my teams. So I'm hoping that he's going to think this is a Zo my Zoroa, but unfortunately he doesn't fall for it. He goes for the payback. I survived with 1 HP. Foolishly I went for the substitute. Had I gone for the Shadow Ball slash Sludge Bomb, I might have actually done some damage to him. Instead, I just have to uh, sack my um, Dark Smoke Puncher with a Sucker Punch that's not going to do anything. And of course he's going to be able to recover all of that health back once he switches out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and send out Hermione. Um, my little bubble here. Uh, he thought this was my Zoroa. This was not my Zoroa. I survived with 3 HP. Maybe he didn't think it was my Zoroa, to be fair. Um, but anyway, I go ahead and get off my Shell Smash. Um, I'm now going to be faster than him, and he can't use Fake Out or anything, and so I'm hoping that I can do a decent amount of damage, and I'm hoping that he's going to think that I have something that I can actually hit him for super effective damage. I don't, by the way. So, um, he does kind of a strange play, uh, I think. He switches into his Star Youth. Um, I go for the Rock Slide. My two attacking moves on this set are Rock Slide and x Scissor. x Scissor is super effective um, and 100% accurate. Had I gone for it, it would have KO'd, but I'm not sure what he... I mean, he must have thought that I could have done something against him. So anyway, um, he, now he switches in Timber. Uh, Timber's gonna go for the Mach Punch. It's obviously gonna take me out. Um, you know, no surprise there, even though I, I actually, no, I don't resist it. Anyway, at this point, I'm going to go ahead and send out Mila. I figure he might run some kind of super effective move, either Payback or Stone Edge, but hopefully once I'm behind my um, Reflex, I can survive. He's going to go ahead and go for the Payback here, and super effective and whatnot, but I do survive with 10 HP, which is great because I think he's going to take me out on the next turn, and in the meantime, I can set my Wish so that whoever I send out next uh, can get some HP recovery on the next turn. Um, so yeah, Payback hits, Neela takes it out, and uh, you know, that's sad. Um, bye bye, Mila. Um, but it is passing off a wish to um, my next Pokemon, Bernie, my Cyndaquil. And so I'm going to go ahead and go for the Eruption. Um, he could have gone for the Mod Punch, and that would have been bad, but I think I would have. Um, eruption might have still done more damage, um, considering uh, you know, I do have the Reflect up. Uh, anyway, yeah, his Drain Punch doesn't do very much to me. I'm, I've still had 14 HP. I'm going to actually get up to back to full um, thanks to that wish. And so now he's going to use Mock Punch just to take me down a little bit. And that, I believe, is going to prevent me from 2 KOing this guy. Um, but, you know, 17 out of 21 HP is still pretty darn good. Um, I can't do the math there, but I think that would probably do the same amount as Fire Blast. Um, and it's 100% accurate. So anyway, um, another eruption is going to take this guy out, even though I've lost some more health due to Mock Punch. Um, and so now his timber is down for the count, and that is excellent for me. Um, so taking out two of his Pokemon, I'm thinking maybe I can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this guy, even though I've lost every time I've battled him in the past, except for maybe once, I don't remember. Um, anyway, he sends out his Chinchou. I'm going to go ahead and send out my Chinchou, um, because that's the only thing I really have that can take on a Chinchou. Um, anyway, yeah, Volt Absorb, whatnot. He's going to go ahead and go for the Hydro Pump here. Um, that's something, okay, great, maybe his Hydro Pumps will miss. As you can see, they're only doing about 5 damage apiece. I go ahead and go for the Scald here and hope for the Burn Hacks, because that's the only way, yeah, he runs EVO like 2, so, um, you know, I don't really think I can do much. He sets up a sub, and I'm like, man, I don't, I don't know whether my spell can even 3 hit KO his sub, so... Uh, I'm just going to have to see what it does. Um, luckily, it doesn't look like he's running the Hidden Power Grass, which would be the only thing I'd really have to fear from this guy. My Reflect wears off, you know, it's been, it's about time. Um, his Hydro Pump hits again. I'm really hoping for the Hydro Pump miss. That's really the only thing that I have uh, to hope for, so some fortunate Hydro Pump hacks. Uh, otherwise, I really don't know how I'm going to take out his chin chop. Excuse me. His substitute does fade, so it is a 2 KO, and he does decide to go for the Hydro Pump here. I'm not sure why he didn't go for the Skull, uh, not, not the Skull, the Substitute, considering it probably would have been a better idea for him. He gets a freaking crit! I'm like, ah, you couldn't miss, you had to crit on me? What the heck? Um, anyway, I'm still not getting the Burn Hacks, even though the odds are like, what, is it 30%? So almost a third, 
Um, but oh well. Um, I survived with one HP, but that's you know that was should have been expected. We did five HP uh, the first time too. Um, so another scald. I'm just hoping for the burn here, and I get it finally. So good job, Chin Chow. Um, you know I'm the residual damage will hopefully let me take it out. He's gonna go ahead and go for the hidden power just to take me out. I'm like, huh? He does run hidden power. I wonder what it is. Um, it's a not very effective hidden power, so really no idea what it is. Um, but he's gonna take he's gonna take some residual damage, and that's gonna be nice. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and send Bernie back out. Except for why is Bernie at full health? Uh, it's obviously not Bernie. It's my Zorua. Um, and I wasn't going for a faking out or anything here. I go for the hidden power. It's hidden power fighting, um, regularly effective and whatnot. Um, he's gonna go ahead and send out Mind Fu here. Um, I don't think he's gonna be fooled because you know obviously if, been, if he's been paying attention, you know I am at full HP. My Cyndaquil was not at full HP. He goes ahead and fakes me out. Um, I am, after all, Chaos, uh, my Zorua. He's gonna go, he is faster than me. This, I believe, was a speed tie, which sucks, because had I been faster, maybe I could have taken him out, or at least done a shit ton of damage with, um, pardon the language, uh, with, uh, a, an extra felt boosted, uh, extra sensory, oh well. Uh, anyway, he goes ahead and sends out Ghastly here. Uh, as I go into my very last Pokemon, my Bernie, um, I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Fire Blast. It misses! Ah! That's okay, it's not like I could've won this anyway. Um, ISS completely sweeps me at, what was this, 4-2? Um, great game. Um, yeah, and as you can see, my team is not unbeatable. Uh, there's always a bigger fish, and, you know, ISS is probably the biggest of the big fish. So, anyway, I really hope you enjoyed that battle. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. So long, folks.